so in last video now we learn how to do that uh, connection of mongoose db okay so now i will go ahead and we can in last one we did this one so now we can try to do that how to fetch that data from there okay so i will go and create one more uh, file and i will give that get data dot js okay so now in this one we'll try to what we can do we already created that connection one so we'll create one variable called const okay and we can put that db connect equals to require okay and now we'll put that name dot slash mongoose db okay so mongoose db we already created so we going to import this one here so that we will get all those connection directly okay and now i will go ahead and create one uh, function that called main okay and i will make this one as async sorry async because we're going to get that promise as a return so we'll make that async and then i will make that arrow function okay so now in this one i will try to do that let data equals to await because we know it will return promise so i will put that now db connect okay so first thing i will go and get that connection where we have that our uh, db name and uh, promise uh, and our collection name so db name this one collection name already provided so now we are try to get that now what i can do that here that i equals to have a, oh no Wait now so we can do data dot find okay dot dot two array okay dot two array so what we'll do dot find will give us all those value and two array it convert in array and now we can put print it in console dot one okay and we can print that data whatever it's coming here and then we are done it now and what we need to do we need to call that our main function okay till now we are good and now other thing what we need to do we need to do it here one more thing that we need to use that module dot export module dot exports equals to db connect okay then only we are exporting it it here and then we are going to import it here okay then these things will work now i will do that save all and then what i will do i will go ahead and put that node and before going to node i will show you what all value we have okay so i've already connected this one e-commerce and product and if you can see i have as of now seven record in this collections okay so now if i go ahead and now try to run node dot slash get dot js okay so you can see all those names are printing it here right m40 samsung 250 xyz abc 12 so if you go and see it here in the same way it's everything is here okay so now we saw that it's connected successfully and we are able to get that result we are able to select all those values from our uh, mongodb okay so i hope you like this video okay if you have any doubt please let me know